I'm gonna paint the wall white. This is me and dad's healthy eating calendar. Bam. My inspiration here is that painting right there. I think that's a little over the edge. And I cannot wait for Mike and Katie and Ryan and Brennan to see it. Okay, let's get to work. So I did a little shopping yesterday for the house. I don't know what you guys remember from the last time you saw it. Okay, so this is our dining room table and I covered the chairs finally, so I'm thrilled with that. So my table is pretty much done. I've got six chairs there with that fabric and I absolutely love it. New lamp coming soon. I have it, I just need to get the electrician. This is new and then I got this off of Facebook Marketplace. Look at that cool chair. I wasn't even looking for a chair to be honest and I came across it and I'm like, okay, it is white and navy blue. This is gonna fit perfectly. And it was the right price, $35, Facebook Marketplace. I found these two lamps. Look at this one right here. And then I put one over here on the entranceway table, the console. So like when you come in the front door and here's your table and this little lamp, it's so cool. Let me turn it on. I love it. The people were stopping me in my with my cart and they're like, oh my gosh, look at that cool lamp. And I put this mirror up. Hi everybody. <laughs> so this is coming together nicely. I do think it needs a little fluffy, a little greenery or something right here probably. Oh, and then upstairs. Oh, I got this. Hold on one second. This is a chalkboard with a beautiful frame on it and I love it. Again, another Facebook Marketplace find. Um, it didn't have any hangers on the back though, so I attempted to put my own hangers on and then I hung it up and then this morning I found it down on the floor and the the frame is broken. So I'm gonna have to try to see if I can go get that fixed and get it rehung because I'm gonna hang it right there so we can write chalkboard. I love writing on a chalkboard. I think it's so much fun. And this was in the clearance section. I literally paid $8 for it. America the Beautiful, isn't that pretty? I love that. And that goes here in the desk area. But let me show you my pride and joy. Look at that. Do you like that? It's a canvas. And it is absolutely what I was looking for, for this room. Um, so this room upstairs, we're gonna be painting this. This is the original wall color. So when we bought the house, we had this color going all the way through the house. And then we painted the downstairs, the Benjamin Moore Chantilly Lace, which is one of my favorite colors. Chantilly Lace is the color that we used on our kitchen renovation at our other house and we did the cabinets and I did the top cabinets a white, which is a Chantilly lace. I absolutely adore it. So this room was also the color that I showed you upstairs and it was the first thing we did when we moved in was change that color. Not that it's a terrible color, but there's not a lot of windows in here and we wanted the walls to pop and just to be crisp and clean. And to me, Chantilly lace is the ultimate like crisp, clean color, I love it. And I should let you know that this um, video today is sponsored by Benjamin Moore, so thank you so much to Benjamin Moore for sponsoring this video. That was an easy peasy one to do because Benjamin Moore is the only paint we use. Um, we have used, we used it all through the downstairs. I'm so excited about it. It is like the epitome of Florida. We were trying to debate and decide what we wanted to do with this room in terms of decoration. And Nana bought that first. We put that up. And I bought these to match, which I absolutely love. So those colors are so Florida and so tropical that I wanted to carry it out here, but I wanted this to be a little bit more sophisticated and not as whimsical, let's say, as the bathroom. So when I, when I saw that, I about freaked out. I'm like, okay, this is the perfect thing. Now it's not hanging up there, obviously, because first of all, I'm gonna paint the wall. And second of all, um, I need to, I just, I just got it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna paint the wall white, which will pick up like the sea foam in this picture. And then can you see where the blues are? Bluish green. I'm gonna paint this table, just the bottom of it, that color. So we're sort of getting the aqua and the corally orange together. I think that's gonna be absolutely beautiful. So stay tuned. I'm excited. Let's go. Benjamin Moore has over 3,500 unmatchable, gorgeous colors, more than any other paint company. And they're all available to try on via the app which is exactly how I decided what color I wanted to use for our table. After trying different colors on the bottom of the table, I decided on Tropicana Cabana. 
First, I'm gonna start with painting the walls with Chantilly Lace, and I'm using Benjamin Moore's most popular wall paint, Regal Select. Look at how beautiful this paint is. It's so thick and creamy. It doesn't splatter, goes on smoothly, covers really well, and offers such a rich color. Arguably one of my favorite parts about Benjamin Moore paint is it cleans up so nicely. It's worth every cent. Okay, let's get to work. I removed the painting and then the furniture, brought in the drop cloth and the ladder, removed all the utility covers and got to painting. Look how beautiful this wall is and this gorgeous matte finish that I used just absorbs the light rather than reflects the light and gives the room such depth and beauty. I'm thrilled. Yay, our two walls are done. So now I'm going to return the furniture to its original position and get ready to paint the table. Instead of doing it in the garage, I decided to do it right here. <laughs> just put out the drop cloth, put the table on top, and get to painting. I got this table um, from Facebook Marketplace. I think I might've paid $25 for it. I'm not crazy about the color. We had it downstairs first and um, then moved it up here because it fits so much better up here. But what I love about this table, first of all, I love the size and I love that it has these little knots in it, these little piney knots. They're absolutely beautiful. So I don't really wanna cover those up. Now with the advanced paint, I will cover up down here. There's some knots down here that will get covered up by the, just by how thick that paint is and how great that paint is. But up here, I'm gonna leave this natural for now. And we might leave it this color or I might try to maybe whitewash it, but whatever I do with it, I wanna make sure that I can still see the knots because I think that's so beautiful and rare to come by these days. All right, so here we go, a little Tropicana Cabana on the bottom of this table. I'm really excited. I've chosen Benjamin Moore's Advanced Interior Product line. This is the product that they recommend for painting furniture and cabinetry like I did at home. My color, Tropicana Cabana in a satin sheen. So today we should sell. It's a great day. Katie and I heading off to where are we going? We're, oh, we're heading off to uh, well, well, practice. We're reviewing our uh, menu for the week. Boom! This is me and Dad's healthy eating calendar. Bam! Well, we pasta. Holy pasta with um, meatballs. And if it was like turkey, you know how we have like turkey chili? Yeah. That's way healthier than red meat. Uh -huh. So if you wanted to go like full health nut, you yeah. can do whole wheat um, yeah. pasta uh -huh. with the tomato sauce. It doesn't have high fructose corn syrup or added sugar. Yeah. And then um, is the turkey more and then expensive? Turkey meatballs. I don't think so. To be honest. Oh. Oops. Oh. Oh. <laughs> but mom gets it like all the time for turkey chili. Oh. So I'm sure we can turn it into meatballs. Oh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> uh. Okay. <laughs> so here's the thing. We're spending too much money on food. So we're going to do some things. So we're going to do like like those Lunchables things. Do you mean to tell me? I think so. There's a thing right there. Dad, Lunchables? Those, those, uh... You cannot get Lunchables. No, no, not Lunchables. Can you deal with this while I tighten it? Sure. Oh, yeah. the, um, not Lunchables. It's, uh... Those peanut butter and jelly sandwiches that are pre-made. Yes, those are good. They're and that's... too expensive. Oh. You can make like 75 peanut butter and jelly sandwiches <laughs> normally for the cost of those. So I think that's kind of the key. Mm. Here's the thing. It's really hard to eat healthy on a budget. I think not. Really? I, I'm not to prove, uh, not prove you wrong, but um, yes. Okay. Well, here's the thing. I think we can get whole wheat pasta for about the same price, very similar price then. Do you want spaghetti or do you want like noodles? Either one. Okay. But the thing is, 
I'm gonna make my own peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. Whole wheat bread. That's what I'm saying. So Dave's Killer Bread is packed with nutrients because it has like the nuts and it has whole whole wheat and whole grain and everything. Agreed. But it's more expensive than if we were to just get white regular bread. I agree. I agree. But you can also get like uh, whole wheat bread for two dollars fifty cents instead of like seven dollars for the. Right, but Dave's Killer Bread is killer. For the, for the, all right, what's next? Okay, peanut butter. Because if you're gonna make peanut butter and jelly, so peanut butter. Yes. It's peanut. It's peanut icing. There's so much sugar in that peanut butter uh, that it's barely it's even peanut butter. It's just a little bit. It's like a tablespoon of sugar, uh, peanut butter. I think that's a little over the edge. Well, just, and then jelly, which has loads of sugar. It's grapes. It's grapes. All right, you can you can read the labels yourself. I'm not like, I'm not hating them. I'm just telling you. All right. All right, what's next? Fish, good. So, salmon. Not tilapia? No. Okay. Salmon, rice, veggie mix. Good. What kind of veggies? Uh, that's a good question. Because I don't love broccoli, unfortunately. I like Brussels sprouts and oh. carrots and cauliflower care. and snap peas and cauliflower. spinach. Cauliflower. Cauliflower is so good. is the glazed donut of vegetables. These donuts are delicious. Ugh, they're just... They're no apple fritter. That's for sure. And what would you say apple fritter is? Uh, <coughs> that's the broccoli of donuts. Broccoli is disgusting, Dad. It's excellent. Unless it's like... And it's good for you. It's unless it's like food. bathed in <laughs> lime ju lemon juice. <laughs> Grilled burger dinner. Good. No. So okay, so we don't have to buy tater tots. We can make those baked baked uh, potatoes. We'll buy a bag of potatoes, cut it up, put some olive oil on it, put them in the oven. We can eat those all week. Boom. Right, but potatoes are very starchy. They're they're roots. They're the least healthy of all the vegetables. Listen. Dad, it's, it's starches are bad. Throw a little ketchup on those, they're just killing it. You don't have to eat them. Your high fructose corn syrup ketchup. <laughs> Dad, I think you're. Okay, you're where do we draw? The you're line? really trying, but like, you know, if you. Want I want to go to the store. I want to spend a hundred dollars, and we're not going to spend any more than a hundred dollars per week on groceries. Okay, well, can, now can we get stuff for my shakes? Because mm. I, this is my breakfast every single morning. Well, I don't know. Do you have to have uh, Chobani yogurt? Can we get like, uh, I don't know, Bob's yogurt or something? Well, I'm not putting Bob's yogurt in my smoothies. <laughs> All right, listen, have a great workout. Thanks, Dad. Dad, I believe in you. Healthy food only, okay? All right, good luck. Love you. Oh, wait, can I have a piece of gum so when I'm done Hi, with this? Hi, Arden. Congratulations on your uh, driver's license. It's fantastic. Dad. Drive Dad, safely. Dad. Yes. Can I please have a piece of gum? Thank you. All right. Love you. Love you more. Bye, guys. <laughs> love that girl. All right, you guys. My night has come to an end, and I have accomplished everything I wanted to accomplish when it comes to this room so far. I still have other things I want to do, but as far as painting and the picture and making it all come together and really having a vision for what this room is and what it's going to be when it's completely finished, I'm absolutely thrilled. Let me show you what I did. I painted the accent wall, actually two accent walls. I did that wall over there and this wall over here. Now look at the difference between this color and the Chantilly lace. It makes the room so much brighter, and that was completely my goal. It's still warm, but crisp at the same time. It like helps it pop. So I'm so happy with that. And then the picture was my inspiration for colors. And this is my table. Look at the table. Originally, I thought I wanted to do the table you know, like a solid, but I'd used a dry brush method instead to make it a little bit more beachy. So what do you guys think? Do you like that? I have to say, I think I love it, but comment below. If you guys don't like it, if a majority don't like it, then I'll paint it so it's solid. But I have to say, I really, maybe I won't, maybe I won't paint it. <laughs> I really like the way this turned out. So I'm really, really thrilled with the work. Um, that, that I did today and I cannot wait for 
Mike and Katie and Ryan and Brennan to see it. Um, I think with the way these walls turned out, I think I'm gonna keep going and do the rest of the walls up here. I thought maybe I would just do one or two, but I'm gonna keep going because I just love the way this white looks up here. It actually looks different than it does downstairs. It's even crisp and, crisper and cleaner downstairs. And up here, it's just a little bit warmer. And I don't know if it's the lighting or the couch, I'm not sure, but I I love it. I, I'm so thrilled. So it makes this room so much more cozy and um, almost looks bigger. Not that it needs to be bigger, it's a pretty big room. So this is a great room for um, the kids to hang out, for us to watch movies, um, and just be like a second living room for them. So I'm very thrilled. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's vlog. I hope you enjoy watching this makeover. And comment below what you think. If you have any other ideas of what we should do with the room or what you, if you like this dry brush method, um, if you like the painting and the wall color, I'd love to hear what you have to say. So also comment below what made you guys happy today. Definitely what made me happy is is this room coming together. I, I'm over the moon thrilled with it. I'm so excited and I just love this color. This color is just, it just makes me happy. It's beautiful. I hope you agree. So thanks so much for watching. Comment below what made you guys happy today and we will see you tomorrow. Bye. Shop itsthedonnellys.com for the latest in Live Happy and It's the Donnellys merchandise. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.